UAB has lined up for the kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. From his own goal line, tackle made at the 17-yard line. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. the 27-yard line. It's second and inches. Ball on their own 27. He's out of bounds at the 29. So they throw it to the big guy, and they'll move the chains. First down. Well, they got to him in a hurry, but it was just a little bit too late. That's a nice first down pass. Inbounds to make a nice catch. From their own 42-yard line, first down. They come out in a five-wide set. Catches it, and that's all. They got four yards on that one. You know, little passes like this force the defense to start to come up. Then you can see an offense take their chances downfield later to take advantage of the defense starting to cheat up. Man left, man left. Four down, four down. Check three, check three. Let's go. Black and five. Uh -huh. That was just smash mouth, helmet to chin football by the defensive line there. They dominated the point of attack. Third down, nine to go. Ball on their own 43. Mike 51, Mike 51. Ready. He airs it out. Tackle made at about the 17 yard line. This guy's combination of speed and his hands make him lethal. He can take a game over at any time. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Mike 51, Mike 51. Let's go! Francis Yates! Tackled for a loss. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. This is the ninth play of this drive. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Scrambling around. They'll make the sack. You have to keep an eye on this guy, especially during passing situations, because he does a great job of getting to the quarterback, as we saw right there. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Kicks away, and the field goal is good. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The Blazers in talking with them this week, Kirk, is just interesting their perspective on this kid, how good he is, and how much they can lean on him. Yeah, you and I had a chance to visit with not only the coaches, but the player himself. And I got a real good vibe walking out of those meetings and thinking that he's going to have a huge game. The coaches seem confident in being able to get him to football in different areas on the field. This kid has a look in his eye that I haven't seen in a long time, where he just wants to have a chance to have an impact on the game and on the outcome. And I, I'd be shocked if they can slow him down. From the 47-yard line, first down. He 
makes it to the 45-yard line. That makes it second and eight. They'll bring him down at the 29-yard line. Call the gain of 16 yards. First down. From the 29-yard line, it's first down. throws this one away. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. He's taken down at the 20-yard line. That's good for a game of nine yards. That'll make it third and one. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. Larry, Larry. Mike 35, Mike 35. Ready. And he's tackled at the 19. He keeps it and picks up maybe a yard. That makes it fourth and inches. Gains his way to the seven-yard line. Great job here converting and keeping this defense on the field. They're getting very tired. And this play is number eight on the drive. Mike 35, Mike 35. Finds the tight end for a touchdown. So he was able to connect with a tight end for the score. Yeah, they did a nice job inside the red zone of mixing up the play calling. That touchdown obviously fooled the defense. And he converts the extra point. It was an eight-play, 76-yard drive, and they put up seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. He'll return it from the one. They'll bring him down at the 33-yard line. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. It's on the ground. Defense says they've got it, and they do. And he carries the ball for a nice game. The running back won't be happy that he lost the ball. He's got to forget about it and get ready for the next series. His offense is going to need him again. Well, they had a lot of success on their last possession, and now they're going to start this one off with excellent field position. It's hard to ask your defense to come out and make a stop when they're already backed up this far within their own end zone. Out of bounds at the 27. We've got a second and nine here. Ball on the 27. UAB holds a four-point lead. Fires out to his wideout, and he's taken down right around the 10-yard line. Number eight makes the tackle at the 10-yard line. That makes it first and 10. From the 10-yard line, first down. Release tight end incomplete. Number 86 was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and 10. Mike 35, Mike 35. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Loss is seven yards on the play. That'll bring up third and one.
Well, we had a pitcher's duel in that low scoring first quarter. 7 3, Blazers. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Strike to his receiver, no good. Pretty good effort here by the quarterback of trying to squeeze that ball into a tight spot. Yeah, I know it was incomplete, but he didn't have too many other options. They'll line it up for the field goal. He gets it up, and it's Quincy uprights. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Excellent kick. And they can forget about returning this one. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. They're about four yards away here on second down. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. And they get nice yardage on that run. That's good enough to pick up the first down. If you can consistently get four or five yards at a pop, you know that you're going to have a functioning offense. One yard gain by the halfback. Boy, the senior linebacker's experience really showed on that run. He that sniffed it out perfectly and, and made the tackle. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 36. Mike, Mike 51, Mike 51. I think he could have taken a risk down the field, but he played it safe instead, and that's one of the keys to winning ball games. An empty backfield with five wide receivers. Throws it in a hurry. And they make the stop around the 50-yard line. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 50-yard line. On the throw, incomplete pass. Number three was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and ten. Four down, four down. 51, Mike. Mike, 51. The offensive line had a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Tackle at the 28-yard line. The delay gave the back some room to run, and he was able to pick up about nine yards. So it's second down and about two yards to go. They go with the run, and he's tackled in the backfield for a loss. Behind the line. Loss of two on the play. That makes it third and three. And this is the 11th play of the current drive. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. He's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. He's tackled at the 15-yard line.
from the 15 yard line. First down. Just throws this one away. Play 13 of the current drive. And down he goes at the six yard line. So again, a third down as the offense lines up. Drop down at the four. Unbelievable. They can't get this offense off the field. Oh, they've been like a machine on this drive. Very methodical and efficient. And once again, they're moving the chain. Takes a hand up, but brought down before it could go anywhere. This is the 16th play of this drive. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. Tackle made at the four-yard line. No game. That makes it third and goal. It's third and goal, and they're about four yards out. They'll spread the field with five wide. He's on the run. He's wrapped up for the sack. That brings us fourth and goal. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. North Texas is ready to kick it away. He's tackled at the 18. A really defensive battle going on right now so far, Kirk. Well, the defenses are flying around the football, doing a good job. I think both offenses are making it a little easier because of their style of game plan. I think a lot of the offensive coordinator, take a few chances. Be willing to open it up and try to give your quarterback a chance to make a play. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. UAB is up four. Makes it out to about the 26. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. A tight first half of football, and we head to the break. The Blazers lead it by four. We played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. Defense has been dominant in this game. Yards very hard to come by. But David, as we get deeper and deeper into this game, the natural assumption is that the pressure goes to the offense to do something. Yeah. How much pressure is on the defense not to make that catastrophic mistake? Well, that, that's, the, that's the conundrum you get in. I mean, it makes it exceptionally tough because you want to play perfect and you want to get them to punt every single time, but it's not the way it works, and it's those big plays that you usually see that kill the defenses and break their backs, and you can hold them great, Reese, on first down, second down, it's third and long, you're in a perfect situation, you give up that one play for 80, and it changes the whole complexion of the game, so I think you got to have a little bit of both. It can't just be great defense the whole time. Usually the teams that play great defense can keep you in it, but only for so long. At some point, that offense has to get something going. That's going to do it for David and me here in the studio. Time to get you back to the game. Red and Kirk ready to take you home in the second half. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. 
He really got a hold of that kick. So you wonder what kind of excitement we'll see this time around. UAB is up by four. And a quick throw. They'll bring him down at about the 33-yard line. That's a gain of eight on the play. That, that makes, makes it second, second and two. two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Four down, four down. Watch number five, watch number five. Ready. They'll knock him down for a loss. Scrambled. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. And that was a nice pickup by the quarterback. Brad, I think this guy's amazing. He has an uncanny ability to scramble, and it showed right there on that play. From their own 46-yard line, it's first down. Side run there. That makes it second and two. taken down at the 29. I think play action is a big part of this offense and what they're trying to do today. It's, you know, they're running the football and they're mixing in some play action. And what that does is it freezes the linebackers and the safeties and puts a lot of pressure on them to have to be able to defend both the run and the play action. And as a play caller, when I know I can go to play action pass, boy, I feel really good about it's getting my quarterback in rhythm, slowing down the defense and giving us a chance to make big play. He makes his way to about the 18. Call the game of 11 yards. First down. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 18. UAB holds a four-point lead. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. That brings up second and nine. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Take four, take four. I smell fear now. I smell fear What a play, and that is first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. First and goal. Zips it to the tight end, and he's level at the three. Only three yards there on the throw. Doesn't look like this defense is going to let them beat him with the deep passes. So they'll allow those short completions to the tight end. Tenth play of the drive. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. And he's tackled at the two-yard line. And he gets a yard on the run. And that's the safety who stepped up to make that tackle. It's third and goal from the two, and they're trying to make this a two-possession ball game. Mike 35, Mike 35. Touchdown, UAB! And he adds the extra point. They're ready for the kick. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. Oh, it's 
it's the kicker that comes up with a tackle. Everywhere we go in college football, everybody's got a T-shirt that says finish, finish, whether that means finish the game or finish the drive. Right now, this offense is moving the ball, but they're not finishing the drive. They got to execute better down closer to their opponent's territory. He's to the 40. Makes it out to about the 49. And he has a huge run. I'll tell you right now, this guy is arguably one of the fastest players in college football today. There you see him turn it upfield with such fluidity and quickness. It's first and 10. Ball on their own 49. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. Call it a game of two yards. That makes it second and eight. He'll get it again. He fights forward to about the 46. That's a game of three on the play. From the 46 yard line, it's third down. And they got him. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. That makes it fourth and 12. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. And this one is a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. A touchdown was the end result of their last drive as this offense moved the ball very well with their passing game. So much of the passing game is about the timing between the quarterback and his wide receivers. And right now with this offense, they are in sync, and really the timing and execution is flawless. Makes it to the 22-yard line. That makes it second and eight. From their own 22-yard line, second down. Tackles him hard at the 19 yard line. That's a great play by the defense. There's nothing like a defense being able to slip off of a block, get into the backfield of the offense, and then make a play in the backfield to be able to create some momentum possibly for this defense. He's going left. Knocked down, incomplete. Number four was the intended receiver on the play. Fourth down. at the 45-yard line. Their last drive ended in a punch, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Run play, and he'll lose yards. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. The Blazers in front by 11. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Mike 51, Mike 51. Ready! Ready! They pick up two on the fast play. Wasn't a huge gain here, but at least you know as a quarterback that when you throw to this senior, you're putting the ball into some sure hands. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 35. And he goes down quickly. Number 23 makes the tackle at the 37 yard line. That'll make it fourth and two. Check four, check four. Let's go. 
and he's taken down right around the 24-yard line. From the 24-yard line, first down. Give to the tailback. And he is drilled at the 13. You're not going to be able to get by a sure tackler like this linebacker too often. That'll make it second and seven. Second down and seven coming up here. Ten yards to the end zone. Mike 51, Mike 51. Tackle after a decent run up the gun. This is the eighth play of this drive. Touchdown, Mean Green. So the kicker is going to stay on the sidelines. These guys will try for a two point conversion. Number North Texas ready to kick this one off. They'll bring him down at the 27. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. Brad, at this point, this defense has to do everything in their power to try to strip that ball away to get the ball back to their own offense to see if they can get a chance to win this game. It's complete. And they push him out at the 39-yard line. Gain of 12 yards. First down. From their own 39-yard line. First down. Less than three minutes in the game. From the 45 yard line, it's first down. Three down, three down. Mike 35, Mike 35. Hey, Red 85, Red 85. Hut, hut. at the 44. The halfback picks up a yard. And he's brought down there by the senior at linebacker. That won't be the last time today we'll be talking about this young man. They're packed in tight on the line. Takes it right. He can't get back to the line of scrimmage. That's got to be very frustrating for that running back. This offense is trying to get in sync and trying to get a rhythm established. And for such a negative play to happen, loss of yards, it can really have a negative impact on the offense and what they're trying to do. It's a fumble. And the ball bounces out of bounds. I really thought the defense had a chance to get their hands on it, but the ball went out of bounds first. That's got to be disappointing. From the 31-yard line, first down. Gets out to around the 18. 
You know, the defense knew that this offense was trying to work the clock. When you want to work the clock, you're going to run the football. It puts a lot of pressure on the offensive line to get low and drive that defensive line back. And that's what they were able to do there to give the running back enough room to pick up that first down. And this play is number eight on the drive. Under a minute left in the game. The stop at the 12. Eight eight yards. That'll bring up third and four. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Four down, four down. Mike 35, Mike 35. Let's go. Red 18. Red 18. Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game. And now the offense has got a chance to win it. Blazers coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player after the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Street, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.